Hi kids, it's time to learn with Miss K. Today we are going to read the story of Slowly, 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 Said the Sloth by Eric Carl. Come on and join Miss K. Slowly, 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 Said the Sloth by Eric Carl. Slowly, 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 a sloth crawled along a branch of a tree. Do you know where the sloth is? The sloth is right there. And this is how a sloth looks like in real life. Sloth. Sloth. This is a sloth. Slowly, 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 the sloth ate a leaf. Oh, look at the sloth. He's eating a leaf. Um, yum, 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 yum. Slowly, 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 the sloth fell asleep. Shh, keep quiet. The sloth is sleeping. Slowly, 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 the sloth woke up. All day long, the sloth hung upside down in the tree. All night long, the sloth hung upside down in the tree. Even when it rained, the sloth hung upside down in the tree. Why are you so slow? The howler monkey asked one day. But the sloth didn't answer. This is a howler monkey. A howler monkey. Let's see how a howler monkey looks like in real life. Howler monkey. This is a howler monkey. Why are you so quiet? The caiman asked. But the sloth didn't answer. This is a caiman. A caiman. Let's see how a caiman looks like in real life. Caiman. Caiman. A caiman looks like a crocodile or alligator. Why are you so boring? The ant eater asked. But the sloth didn't answer. What animal is this? This is an ant eater yes this is an ant eater let's see how an ant eater looks like in real life oh look at the ant eater it's called an ant eater because it eats ants do you know where the ants are oh look at the ants they're right there hi ants Tell me, said the jaguar, why are you so lazy? The sloth thought and thought and thought for a long, long, long time. <gasps> what animal is this? This is a jaguar. Jaguar. Let's see how a jaguar looks like in real life. Finally, the sloth replied, It is true that I am slow, quiet, and boring. I am lackadaisical. I dawdle and I dilly dally. I am also unflappable, languid, stoic, impassive, sluggish, lethargic, placid, calm, mellow, Laid back and well, slothful. I am relaxed and tranquil, and I like to live in peace. <gasps> but I am not lazy. Then the sloth yawned. Hi, can you please yawn? Hi, and said, That's just how I am. 
I like to do things slowly, slowly, slowly. The end. And that's the story of... Slowly, 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 said the sloth. Oh wait, did you know that there are so many fun things to know about the sloth? Let's read what the friend of the author has to say about the sloth. The sloth exists in the jungles of South America. There are two species, the three-toed and the two-toed. Three-toed means they have three toes, of course, and the two-toed means they have how many toes? Two. Sloths can turn their heads about 270 degrees. They can also hang from one leg and rotate their bodies in a manner most horrifying to observe through almost 360 degrees. Oh my goodness, that is so awesome. As humans, we cannot rotate our heads 360 degrees. That means to say, we cannot fully turn our head. But sloths can do that. They spend their lives upside down, hanging from the branches. They feed mostly at dawn and dusk on shoots and blossoms, leaves and fruits. After feeding for a few hours, sloths move slowly from one branch to the next, then they fall asleep. They sleep 15 to 19 hours out of 24 hours. That's a long time to sleep. They are hanging from a branch with their heads laid on their bellies. Can you touch your belly? That's great. They look just like a part of the tree because a kind of green algae grows in strange grooves on their long coarse hairs so that they become the same greenish color as their forest world. All kinds of moth and beetles live in their fur. If the sloth are threatened or meaning they are scared, they defend themselves by striking out with their powerful arms and dagger-like claws. Sloth live in the same tree for days, sometimes even weeks. About once a week, when they're looking fat, they climb slowly down to the ground where they defecate or where they poop and urinate or where they pee and they carefully bury their waist and climb slowly back, looking slim. When they do move to a new tree, they may have to swim across a river, but this is a surprise. They are surprisingly fast swimmers. Sloths are silent animals. Occasionally, they comment on life with a gentle sigh that sounds like, Oh, how fun is that? So those are the things to learn about sloth. I hope that you enjoyed our story time today with Miss K. Don't forget, we have more stories in our channel. But for now, Miss K has to say bye. Bye, kids.